Yes, you saw slash are seeing that correctly. It is five in the morning and I'm awake. But I promise I'm not an imposter and the world is not ending. My internship supervisor just asked me if I could come in at 6.30 today and it's in university place so I had to wake up really early so I could get ready and then drive over. I know my attire doesn't look super professional but that's because my internship is at a gym slash strength and conditioning place and um, can't film there so I promise I promise I'm not just going to be going back to sleep but uh, I'm going to drive over there now get ready for work and stuff and uh, when I get back we'll continue the vlog. Um, just so you know a little bit of what to look forward to, we are bringing back horse today and I know that you'll be super excited for that because I've been getting a bunch of people asking me when I'm going to bring it back. I am back from the first day of interning at Summit Strength and Conditioning and uh, it went well. Um, I'm already a certified personal trainer as all of you guys very well know so uh, I'll be able to actually do stuff while I'm interning there so that'll be fun. Only downside really is I don't get paid to do what I already get paid to do. But yeah, so I'm going to do some homework and study for a quiz and uh, I'll keep you filled in on what's happening next. So, uh, physique update. This is what I'm looking like. I have had some water and I have had some coffee. Still haven't eaten anything on the back. So as you can see, I'm quite a bit leaner. It's been about three weeks, I think, since the last vlog. So kind of just wanted you kind of wanted to update you guys on my progress. I'm very happy with how things are going. I've been leaning down so I could film some ads. Hopefully those will be filmed and then out very soon. The snow and snow apocalypse and stuff like that has kind of affected that, but uh, I'm very, very happy to show you guys my progress. My programs really do work and they work very well. I used to be 220 pounds, as you guys know. But yeah, so I'm very excited to put those out because as soon as I do, I'm going to start lean bulking so I can put on some muscle mass because I'm tired of being tiny and not eating anything every day. That, that's a joke. I am just eating in a you know moderate deficit. I wouldn't suggest starving to anyone, but you guys know. Just a little bit of humor. Hey, for those of you who don't know, I put out a lot of information on YouTube through videos, but I also do a lot on Instagram. I put out stories, posts, things like that pretty much every single day to help you with your fitness needs, whether it's answering questions I get in my DMs, whether it's putting up polls or asking you guys or teaching you things about calories and stuff like that. So if you're not already, go follow at Sub7Fitness on Instagram. I actually have the setup right now for filming today's story, but as you could probably hear just a second ago, the uh, fire alarm is making this really loud beeping noise every few minutes, and it won't go away no matter what I try. I think that means it needs new batteries or something like that, so I fill the work order out. I might have to take my IG setup, and uh, I might have to go film outside, it is a beautiful day today, so if I do have to do that, you know, it's not the end of the world, and I'll be seeing you soon.
warmed up and we are ready to work out. So I'm gonna be doing some of that and then I'm gonna be teaching you guys pretty much everything you need to know about what intermittent fasting is. Today is all about intermittent fasting. It's something that I personally love, a lot of my clients do, and uh, something that isn't super necessary for hitting your goals, but something that can definitely be a great tool for helping you get to your goals. There's a plethora of benefits, but today we're all about what it actually is. So intermittent fasting is the practice of splitting your day into two periods. You have an eating window and a fasting period. The most common style of intermittent fasting is the 16-8, which is where you don't eat for 16 hours, and for eight hours you get all the calories that you would need or all the calories that you'd want to get in that one day in that eight hour window. Now I know 16 hours sounds like a lot, but you can't forget that that also includes the time that you're asleep. When you're asleep, you're not hungry because you're asleep. So it really, it's kind of like waking up and waiting six to eight hours, depending on how long you slept and how long the night before you stopped eating at. So basically, by splitting your day into these two succinct periods, you're cutting down on your eating window. The average American eats constantly throughout the day. They have breakfast, a snack, lunch, a snack, dinner, and then dessert. So a total of at least six meals. And if you're not doing it in the bodybuilder style of really tiny portions with chicken and rice and broccoli and things like that, you're probably gonna be in a surplus of calories. Intermittent fasting is great for fat loss because it helps you to eat less calories and it's been shown in studies that people who eat in an intermittent fasting protocol, or at least in the study, just that people who skip breakfast, but I mean, if you skip breakfast, you're pretty much doing intermittent fasting, especially if you do it in a regimented way, that you eat on, they ate on average 200 less calories than people who ate breakfast. So even people who weren't trying to were helping themselves restrict their calorie intake so that they could lose fat as fast as possible. There's a lot of benefits in intermittent fasting as well, and I'll be going into those in a future video. So every Friday, we test our functional training by playing a game of horse. Just like horse and basketball, if I shoot from a certain spot, the next person has to shoot from that same spot. If they miss, they get a letter. We just do that with calisthenic movements instead of a basketball. So if I were to do one push-up and the next person couldn't do a single push-up, then they would get an H. With that being said, let's hop right into the game.
So the game is all done, ended with a tie, me and Bennett, Evan played really well. He actually did better on like every single one of them he's ever done before, so I'm super proud of him. And uh, we'll look forward to the next game of horse next Friday. So definitely drop any questions you have below. Before I end the vlog, I just want to say thank you guys for helping me to get to over 100 subs. I'm super excited for how fast we're growing, and I couldn't be doing it without you. So please continue to support the channel, like, comment, subscribe. Share this video out with people that you think will, will be helpful for, for anyone who is kind of questioning whether intermittent fasting is for them or not, if they want to know what it is. And uh, stay tuned for all the big things coming. I'm super, 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 super excited to be writing this book and to launch the website officially. It should be up very, very soon. So, like always, I'm Joey Kane, sub7fitness.com, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.